Welcome. You're going to need uh, some extra PLA and a printed out extra strap for this repair. You also need a pilot hole uh, drill about 1 16th and a T8 Torx bit. First, find out which side of your strap is broken. Here for us it's the right side. Flipping it over, the first thing to do is to expand it out so we have a little bit extra room. Which we do. And then what we're going to do is run a pop off the back head band uh, pad. To do that, take a small device like a tweezers, stick it inside of the strap opening, and pop it. That should then just peel right off. This exposes the uh, large black plastic piece and the T8 screw that goes into the middle, holding everything together. Just take that screw out and then remove the larger plastic piece. This takes a bit of force. You can't simply use a pair of tweezers, as I discovered, uh, but a needle nose is pretty good. It shouldn't take an excessive amount of force, but you do have to pry it a bit. Once it kind of pops on you there, then you can pull the whole piece out. Next, there's a ratchet that's clipped in to the middle of the adjustment wheel. There are two little flanges on there that you need to squeeze together in order to be able to remove that ratchet. Once you pull those out, you can see that it actually has the gear that interface with the teeth on the strap. Next, we moved on to uh, attaching our printed out strap to the existing strap. Simply make sure it's in the right orientation uh, the teeth on this strap should be opposite of the teeth on the good strap. So if the good strap is up, then this one needs to be down. Uh, put it on place on the existing strap and drill two pilot holes. Check that your PLA fits. Uh, if your pilot holes were the same size, it fits. Otherwise, step them up to the proper size. Uh, next, we go in and we check how much of the old strap we want to have left. The thing to remember here is however much old strap you leave, uh, that will be the limit uh, for your tightening on the headband. This extra bit of thickness will keep it from going into the back of the headband again. We cut ours to about one inch in length. We moved on to uh, creating what I call rivets. So by slightly melting uh, the end of some of the PLA, letting it cool for just a second and then tapping it down with a spatula, uh, you can create rivets. Uh, give yourself extra length here. I give myself about an inch on each of these. Uh, makes it easier to feed them through. Once you've created your two rivets, uh, put them back in, hold them in place, and then trim them off to about a quarter inch of length. It would help if you had a third hand here, but as I didn't, we uh, just held it all together, heat up the small spatula, and melt that rivet in to hold it all together. The next one, since we had it in place then, I was able to use a little bit more force to melt it in using the needle nose pliers and the spatula in order to get a better purchase on it. That's uh, pretty much the hardest part of it. Now we just reassemble. You have to uh, put the two straps in and hook them over the post that that T8 screw will screw into. Again, you should be looking at one set of teeth up and one set of teeth down at this point. Once you get those in, make sure that they're even. It's not terribly important to have them exactly even because you can sort of click through, uh, but get them as even as you can. Drop the adjustment wheel in. The dent should be towards the front. Clip in the gear into the middle of it. Should engage with the teeth. And you should feel it actually adjusting if you were to screw it a little bit. Take the larger black component, plastic component, clip it into place, and last, reinstall that T8 screw. That holds the whole assembly together. At this point, you should be able to check your adjustment. Again, you'll notice on the left-hand side, it's not going to go all the way down for us. Uh, we went in and we actually screwed, uh, taped up a 
bit of electrical tape around that on our repair as well. Finally, simply click in the pad on the back side. And you are done. I hope you found this helpful.